Hi everybody, I'm Kayla from h, &H Tactical and today I'm going to go over how to install a Technoclip by MN2 onto a Ruger LCP2 380. We're going to do the right hand side, left hand installation is you know, just reverse. But uh, so I highly recommend the Technoclips, especially if you don't wear a belt, if you wear leggings, uh, don't holster or anything. This can clip inside your waistband, inside a pocket, in your purse. Uh, I find them very versatile and very nice for uh, concealed carry, but let's get right into it. So they come in these little packages. Like I said, this is going to be for the Ruger LCP2 380. We're gonna do a right-handed install. Um, right inside, it does give you the full directions, but there's no images. So that's where these handy YouTube videos come into play. So first thing we're gonna do, um, make sure you keep everything together. You don't want, want to lose any of the small pieces. They provide screws with little crush washers, the actual Technoclip, um, a little Allen key, and um, a little rip replacement pen. Um, so, well, actually, punch. So the first thing you're gonna do is remove the rear binding post. So when we look at our Ruger, well, first thing we wanna do is make sure we're clear. So we're gonna remove the magazine. We're clear, but always treat it like it's loaded or do the best you can even while you're doing the install. So like I said, when we look at our LCP2 380, on the back right here, you're gonna see this little circle. That little, we're gonna punch that right through. And I like to have the, the firearm on something soft because I am gonna be banging on it. Switched over to the bench because I don't like hitting uh, the punches on glass. So now I can give it a little more. There we go. So like I said, uh, now that we removed that rear binding post, uh, it allowed us the punch that we used to knock this one out uh, is now inserted in that same hole and that is going to allow us to use the screws that are provided in the kit to attach the Technoclip. So we're going to install the Technoclip. Here we go, like such. It's going to, there's only one way it's going to let you do that and it's going to kind of grab around the, the curve of the firearm. You can see that right there. And then it does provide you with two screws in case you lose one. There is a little little crush washer on there already. Keep that on there. Start to kind of thread it through. You can kind of get it started with your fingers there. And it does provide you with an Allen key so that you can tighten it down. Might give you a little resistance because of that crush washer, but and then remember, don't over tighten this because you don't want to strip it. So let's see. And then we feel like. There we go. There. And we are installed. So this is, I mean, how easy was that? So you can do this, no problem. I mean, you can ask your local gun store to do it, but I do encourage you to like to. Give it a try yourself, ladies. I'm looking at you. Um, but there. So here we have it. This is your installed Technoclip. And like I said, if you don't uh, wear a belt or you don't want to wear a holster, these are great because you can just clip it right inside your leggings and it doesn't move. Very easy to conceal. You would never know it's there. So we do sell these at H&H &H Tactical. Um, I will install it for you if you like, but I do encourage you to, you know, try doing some of your own gunsmithing and your own uh, accessories and that sort of thing. But if you ever need help, you know, search our YouTube videos, stop by the shop if you happen to be in Northeastern Pennsylvania. Um, thanks for joining me today. You can shop with us online. It's hhtactical.com. Like I said, if you're in Northeastern Pennsylvania, we're located in Exeter, Pennsylvania like two hours north of Philly, but check the description. You've got all of our social media links in the description. So make sure you follow us everywhere and uh, yeah, check out our other videos for different installs and information on firearms. And we'll see you next time.